mid-July of this year, a tribe that lives around the town of San Antonio in Peru that consists of about 1,300 people started being terrorized almost every night from what the villagers claim are creatures known as Los Pelicaras, which means the face peelers. Eventually, this story and videos made international headlines, which apparently shows the villagers being attacked by what they believe to be seven-foot-tall aliens that were bulletproof and had some kind of disc on their feet that allowed them to hover and fly away. I'm going to play a clip of that event where the villagers are going on the offensive. <laughs> Es impresionante video captó ese instante en que los habitantes le disparan a los supuestos seres, como ven, medio de la noche. Los vecinos dicen que están aterrorizados. Ellos describieron a los entes como gigantes que miden casi siete pies de altura y que visten trajes que parecen de astronautas. Vamos a escuchar. Son extraterrestres estos señores. Son vestidos este, con blindados. Son tipo del hombre verde que parecía el hombre de igualito. Son señores. Yo les valió dos veces y no caen. En vez de que caen se elevan y se desaparecen señores. Los miembros de la comunidad están haciendo vigilias por las noches para protegerse y tratar de capturar a los supuestos seres extraterrestres que dicen habrían atacado a una joven. La verdad es muy extraño este caso. Short clip taken from another night where apparently you can actually see some kind of alien or unknown entity in the distance. <laughs> What's even more bizarre is this is not the only place in South America that this is happening. Apparently there have been reports in Brazil of sightings of things coming from the sky, following people. Here is a reporter interviewing some locals who were chased by something that came out of the sky. Próxima casa do 
meu amigo Márcio, eu, como eu vinha na garupa, eu sentia aquele clarão nas minhas costas. Aquele clarão muito branco, muito forte, do céu, descendo. Acontece que a gente foi com muito medo e aquela luz seguiu a gente mais ou menos uns 300 metros antes de chegar na nossa casa. Na noite que o carro... So what the heck is actually going on? As these locals claim they have suffered injuries and more by these entities and had to get military's involvement. Even this story made international headlines as this didn't seem like some hoax made up by a large group of villagers. You can clearly tell these poor people are being terrorized by something or some alien attack. So apparently after the local military got involved, An article came out claiming that this was the result of illegal miners who were after gold in certain parts of the Amazon jungle. Apparently these miners are using modern technology and scare tactics to drive these villagers from their territories. This has happened before. Miners will go in and try to scare the wits out of villagers by pretending to look like aliens, etc. Ben hands reports of any arrest that I can find. What I would like to know, if this was actually the cause, what in the heck are these so-called illegal miners using to scare these poor people? Are they actually flying around on jetpacks with bulletproof vests? Are they using drones with some kind of scary costume? Sadly, this is where the sound of aliens seems more plausible than miners flying around on jetpacks. Even someone on Reddit sums it up great. In my opinion, whatever is going on in this village, it is no hoax, as it seems these people are actually going through some kind of crazy event, whether it's aliens or something else.